Hello and welcome to Down the Vent. My name's Joe. My name is Matt. My name is Josh. And tonight we're also... Is... <laughs> Go ahead, yeah. If you want to and you. tonight we're also joined by Panic from Panic Games. Go ahead. <laughs> My name is Panic. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to be playing Trekking the World, which is the sequel, I guess, to Trekking the Park, National Parks or whatever. Um, on BoardGameArena.com. Is this new to the uh, the site? I think so. I, I don't think it's been there a long time. Maybe like a couple months. Okay. Cool. Panic is actually... Release. 2011, 08, 13, 18. So it's been there for nine years. Okay. <laughs> this must be correct. Which, or, or that's 20 November 8th. Like Oh, okay. So earlier this month, got it. That sounds good. We'll go with I that. Think the board game itself came out in like July or something. Right. Yeah. So the twenty eleven oh eight makes a little more sense. Why would they write it that way? I don't know. Weird time stamp. Yep. Anyways, Panic has agreed to actually teach us the game. Uh, little does he know what treat he's in for. Yay, uh, <laughs> I don't have to teach a game. So um, we're going to actually, Josh, you want to get it kicked off? And then or is there, what's our time limit? Yeah, yeah. Uh, there is a time seven. limit. I put it on slow speed, so it should be okay. decent. And we're jerks. Oh, you want to know what? Uh, I will do recommended with friends only. No time limit. Mm. 30 days per turn. All right, Matt. You hear that? You got 30 days per turn. Perfect. <laughs> All right, so we're going to kick this game off here, and then Panic's going to go over real quick how to play. I've heard it's pretty simple. So Don't get out of my beard. Matt wait, has... not Matt. Oh, Matt. Waiting for... Wait up, waiting. There we go. Matt has a rat infestation. Pay no attention to that. <laughs> it's not a rat. <laughs> That's what it looks like to me. Oh, cool. It's, it's my turn. So to start out, um, we're going to place our workers, or our our movers on one of the airport spaces. Trekkers, sir. They're trekkers. trekkers. All they, right. They're trekking in the U.S. <laughs> All right. or the world. Tourists. <laughs> um, so you will start out by doing that. And then basically on a turn, you, you move and you take an action. So let's go ahead and just place our guys out first. Oh, sure. I'll so stop. you place them out on an airport. Airport, yep. There's and four airports to choose from. And howdy, Space Dandy! Airports. You can choose from one in each continent. It looks then, like. Then why isn't there seven? Well, I've said uh, what it looks like on here for color-wise. Yeah, there is six. There's no, You're right. There's no Antarctica. I mean, it's at the bottom, but you can't go there. Yeah, that's where I want to travel. That's where I want to start. Not a lot of sites. Josh must choose an airport. Yeah. There we go. Matt. Where are you going to start, Matt? Oh, where do I want to go? I'm going to go to Australia. All right. All right. So <clears throat> first thing you do, you can move by playing your cards. So your hand is up at the top right. Um, okay. Cards your that hand. you have in your hand. Uh, so the numbers correspond with the amount of spaces you can move. So you can play multiple cards to move as many spaces as you have available. Um, that card go from one to three, correct? Yep. Yeah. Okay. And and then in if you look on each continent, there's little cubes on each location. Mm hmm So wherever you stop, you're gonna collect one of those cubes. Okay. And you look on the right side of your briefcase, there's like different color um rows. Yeah. So as you collect those cubes, you'll fill in your briefcase. Um there's point you get points for whoever has the most yellow, blue red and white those are on the bottom left cards of the of this uh like way down below yeah so it's like 5 10 17 25 yep so that yeah. kicks in when you when somebody hits a star when you hit a star so the second one basically so if you get the second yellow then you get the card but somebody can take that from you by going above you so it's kind of like longest road and um Ticket to Ride or Catan, where it can trade between people, correct? Yep, similar to that. And so then like, there's also if you have if, if you have white and like I pick up a fourth white, you 
I would be able to take the white card from you of having the most white cards okay. or white cubes. Yep, that's correct. Okay. So there's also columns on that briefcase, and those points are underneath there. So if you complete the column, you get that amount of points. Ah, uh, okay. Fancy. So that's basically the move. So you move, and you stop, and you pick up cubes. But there's also the section up above here on the left. So we have like Yellowstone, uh, Galapagos Islands, uh, Great Barrier Reef, and Tichin Itchu, or Te Tehuacan. And um, that corresponds with your... So the cards also have symbols. Mm -hmm. So if you look, look at those, those locations, there's symbols on the bottom. So to be able to collect that card, so in the second step, you play cards for the symbols. So to be able to collect, say, Yellowstone, you need three mountains, and you also have to be at the Yellowstone location. Okay. And that's just cards in your hand, though. That's cards in your hand. Okay. And then when your turn's done, you draw up two more cards you can take from the common pool there, or you can draw from the deck. Okay. Um, the only other... So the someone if someone completely... Uh, gets all the cubes in it. So if they get the last cube in the area, they get the li these little map symbols, which are called region bonuses. So you, and they're worth different amounts of points. It's random. Mm, okay. Gotcha. So, so and then, like little map icons off on each continent. Yep. Yeah. Area. So if you, you pick the last cube in that area, you get that um, map icon. Cool. So was there one, two, three, four, five, six? So there's six of those. Um, end game is if somebody gets, if there's five of the six taken, or also if somebody's completed five of the the journey cards on the top left. Okay. Last thing, uh, this is the journey log. So a um, ships at night looks like we got. So swap locations with another player. Draw three cards from the deck. So to be able to activate that after you do your move, you can play two of the same. Uh, color cards or symbol cards uh, to do that action. And it's the same way with B. B lets you move one cube in your suitcase to another row. It now counts as that color. So then you draw three cards after that. So you can play two of the same card to do that. Okay. That's kind of cool. So that's do you have a hand limit size? No, there's no hand limit. That I, I don't believe so. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Cool. So, and that's basically it. So, like I said, if those map uh, region cards or region bonuses go away, five of the six, or mm -hmm. somebody completes five of the um, journey cards. Cool. That's it. Easy peasy. Yep. All right. So, oh, I... there's another rule also, which you forgot. If you start on a plane symbol, you can move to another plane symbol in another country. That is the only time you can ever move from plane destination to plane destinations is if you start your turn on a plane destination. Okay. Correct. And also this map goes around, you know, it circles. Yeah. So if you're in you're in Mount Fuji, you can go to across to California. And, and we and we block no each ranking. other so we can't move we can't move through each other's lines. Mm. Correct. And then also you can't back pass a same path you've already taken. So if you're trying to like go one, two, three to like get to the same like say i'm trying to get to pyramid of giza and i'm one away and i have a three or something i can't go pyramid of giza to petra back to pyramid of giza because i've already used that path got so it you can't recover a path okay cool pretty simple yep it's Sounds a pretty fun. straightforward game all right panic win it let's go all right win so the I game go first here so so we have, and if you look That's at the, nice... oh, go ahead. I like this little setup here. I... This, mm -hmm. is, this is a game I didn't even know existed here. This one's I put on my wish list for for Christmas because I thought it'd be a great family type. Hint, hint, wink, wink, mm -hmm. Josh. <laughs> yeah, if you'd like to know. And also, um, okay. <laughs> if you're not sure where these uh, journey cards are, the top right shows you the continent. That's where they are. Top right of the card. Oh, oh, the destination ones. Okay. Yeah, the destination ones. Yep. Got it. Okay. Like where it's located in the world. Which, yeah, Tiwakons in North America. Got it. 
Galapagos is in South America. Cool. Cool, okay, cool. Yeah, there's nothing in the area I need to go to. So, right, uh, so. you can fly. Oh, okay. I want to fly like an eagle. Oh, so you can do that for free before moving. That's cool. Yep. Okay. As long as you start your turn on an airplane. Then. Right. So you can't, like, move on to an airplane and then take it. Yes, Space Dandy, it is time to hack. Hacker man. Hacker man. You got what? Hazel is a, seems to be very cry when it comes to the nighttime. Just like her right, dad. You, you, you want to say hi to Josh too before I put you away? You didn't say hi to Josh. Say hi to Josh. Guess what, Josh ain't looking at because it's creepy. Say hi, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the Josh or the ferret? Because ferrets really don't make that noise. At least yes. not yet, anyways. Oh, they will. I haven't even played a game with those journey cards yet, so that's this will be something new. Mm. Those do Our... change. All right, Paul, can you explain the entire game again? So you just click buttons <laughs> until you, somebody wins. Okay, Perfect. that's kind of that's what I was thinking. So <laughs> that's what I do in every game. How do you win? Have the most points? You don't okay. win. Okay, I mean I'm not going to, but Space Dandy is complimenting your ferret. Thanks, Space Dandy. Don't do that. He said it looks delicious. Oh, you you eat them? Interesting. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> well, I have. Okay, so I have these colors in my hand, so I'm probably supposed to go to those colors. That would make sense. No. <laughs> it doesn't matter your colors in your hand, Matt. The only time that those matters is the destinations on the top left for completing those. Yep. Sure, I'm going to go here. I don't know what for. Sure. Yeah, and then we'll, we'll, go, we'll go there. You must play your trek cards for a total of one or four or five. Okay. So you have to play your cards, yep, to move. Okay. Draw two, take a tour, take a journey. So you can draw off the face up ones or off the off the deck. Is take a tour collecting the destination card? Yeah. Okay. Which you, which you have to be on that location to collect, correct? Yes. yes. So you can either t draw two cards or take a journey, which is playing two of the exact same card. Well, two matching symbol cards yep, to, the journey log. to do one of the journeys. So most likely you have one card left, so you're going to have to draw two cards. Boom. All righty. Uh, nope, I'm not going to fly. Choose where to move. Mm, here. Yep. Yeah, really, the challenge of this game is just figuring out the timing of getting there with the right cards. Yeah, because it might be like number wise a little bit off. Yeah. All right. Your turn, Paul Ito. <laughs> All right. Um. And also, don't use the wrong cards. <laughs> God knows I've done that. Ah, uh, yeah. All right. I like the look of this game. It looks pretty cool. Most souvenir tiles. Oh, that these are down here. These are tiny. Wow. They're actually full-blown cards in that game. I'm sure. I'm just on this on this they're super duper small. <laughs> Squirt, he's moving on to Tiatuakan. Uh oh, is he gonna get a claim a destination already? Yep. Look at him go. Yep, there he goes. What the hell is that even at? Tiatuakan? 
or which what card, one? Matt? You looking for Table like, Mountain? That'd be in Africa. Yeah. So the, the card it tells you what continent. Oh, is. I see. I see. It shows the top and it even has the same color, so it's like red, red. Yep. Orange, orange, green, green, blue, blue. And also the two right cards I didn't mention too. One's worth three more points, and one's worth five more points. Dang! So Josh got five more points for taking the furthest one to the right. Yep. What's the eleven on top of it, and the eighteen on top of the one on the like written in black text? So it says eighteen, and it's got the three. It just added it for you. It then adds it for you. So the bottom at the bottom. Well, eighteen plus five is not eleven. That's twenty-three, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And sixteen plus three is <laughs> nineteen. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Neither of them are right. I think that's the intent. But okay, it's hard to say. It's a good question. So to get these islands, you just have to have those things and then land on it. Yep. Okay. Yeah. More like can land you, on it with those things. Can you pick up the last one from that location and claim it? Well, you get the cube. Weapons if you don't have cards You're in your hand. You're not using the cubes to pay for it, Matt. You're using cards in your hand. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. Did I break the game? Well, it says it's, it's panic. panic. No, I'm going. I know, yeah. What happens if you don't have cards in your hand? Because it says moving is required. You, you, uh, just, you, you draw cards. Card, you draw cards. Yeah. Okay. Or if somebody's path is blocking you, you draw cards. Okay. Dang, bruh. Dang, look at everyone clean pleading these things already. There is our good start. I'm confused. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> So what the hell are the cubes for? The cubes fill up your case, your suitcase, over on the right. I thought, I thought Matt was joking when he said re-explain the rules, but he, literally, so. but he literally didn't listen at all, did he? After you have two you of take the a same nap. color, and you have more than anybody else, you get to claim the most of that color, and there's a card at the bottom. So right now I have two red, so I have the most clothing. So I have an extra 10 victory points at the end of the game as long as I keep that. So right now it's showing I have 25 victory points because of 15 plus that 10. If you fill up a column, one blue, one red, and one white, I get the victory points at the bottom of that column. So five victory points. I fill up the second row, I get 10 victory points. So in a bunch. So okay. So it's good to get a variety, but it's also good to go really far on one end. And you get unlimited amount of cubes also, so you can't like cap out on cubes. Right, yeah, but <clears throat> where's the next one? So like ticket to ride explanation and Matt still couldn't figure it out. Oh. <laughs> nope. Okay, next turn. Alright. Um what is out here? Angel Falls. Yeah, you don't want to go there. It's garbage, I've heard. <clears throat> That's probably the closest for me. Yeah. But it's... Uh... All right, I got to draw cards, cards anywhere. Galapagos Island. Uh, going for those high point ones. I'll wait till you get there, then I'll swap it with you. That's what Ooh, happens. That's an go. interesting idea. <laughs> If I can get two of the same card, nope. Right. Fail. <clears throat> Paul, can you grow your beard longer, please? <laughs> Why? Why do you ask? I, I, I mean, don't know. That... I, just, I just feel like it should be longer. It used to be. I don't know, you trimmed everything. I don't, I don't. You're like a different person. Are yeah. you sure you're Paul? Can I see some identification? <laughs> we need your social I'm security number. <laughs> I'm actually, actually Saul. Oh gosh. The evil twin. <laughs> oh no. That sounds evil. Or the good twin. I don't know which. Oh yeah, there you go. Panic was the evil twin. <laughs> the whole time. <laughs> so like that, you have two blue and two red, so you're doing decent so you have the blue card claimed which i think is worth 10 victory points 
11 victory points. So they're not all worth the same. So it goes 9 for white, 10 for red, 11 for blue. All colors should be yellow. the same, Josh. They're not. <laughs> They're all not equal points. Seems like yellow is harder to come by. Probably less cubes, I guess, in the bag when you mix it up. Mm -hmm. Well, shoot. How come no, there aren't any uh, ferrets amount. on this map? That's not cool. Because <laughs> ferrets are a trash animal. No, they're not. They were <laughs> a trash animal. <laughs> so it's like it's like it's nice. like worse than a panda. So it's it's, it's like uh, it's like dirt pandas. You mean raccoons? Nope. Trash pandas. That's a raccoon. raccoon uh, what did you guys do here? You're stealing all my good stuff. I want. I mean, they're most related to like pole cats. No, it's Tolkien. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, remember, Joe, I told you I caught up with the Mandalorian? Mm hmm. So, the beginning of the last episode that came out almost gave me a heart attack because the thing kind of looks like a ferret. And I was like, no. <laughs> the thing kind of looks like a ferret. Yeah, yeah. Oh! The beginning of the episode, there was the creature. Yeah, that definitely. They were, they were gonna. They were gonna eat it. Yeah, that well, definitely. Why said the same thing? She's like, "Ew, look! It looks like an ugly ferret, like Matt has." <laughs> yep. See, <laughs> oh, amazing. Not ugly. Hey, so why does Yellowstone have a four plus on it? What does that mean? Where? On the map. Oh. It just means if you have more than four players, you would put a cube on ah, it. Ah, okay. Because yeah. this game plays up to five people. Ooh, so four or higher it gets a cube. Got it. Yeah. <clears throat> so it just happened to be blank because of hmm dude they're so freaking smart so far I was worried about like letting them loose in the room or the house but they're Pretty chill, actually. Oh, man. I almost feel like I need to get out of this area. We're all like bunched in here. Mm -hmm. um, Just don't come to Australia, please. I'm enjoying my time alone over here. <laughs> <laughs> Australia. Yeah, that's where I'm at. Well, I know I'm technically now in like uh, I don't know what that oh, is. Oh. I see, like wow. you're over there. <laughs> Name suggestions: Charles the Sixth, the Beloved, and Charles the Sixth, the Mad. Double Charles. How exciting! <laughs> okay, so originally we were gonna get two ferrets and name them Bert and Bert, but two different Berts. One was gonna be Bert Reynolds. And then, um, who's the other bird that's from the cure? How did you What's move name? so far? And Ernie. Butt no, it wasn't like two, and Ernie. Two threes. I played Bert, two three cards. Bert Macklin. Or I was going to do, um, FBI. Ferret Bueller. But then I got attached to it and didn't want to give him a joke name. How about Charles Xavier? Ooh. I wonder if that's how many steps away that place is from you. No, nine is really high, isn't it? Let me see. Where's Table Mountain at? No, because mine says nine and 17 also, Joe. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yep, same here. Huh. Where Shooter is the door. table? What are you looking for? Table, table mountain. Mountain's oh, at the very bottom. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, ninete
six away. Don't you forget about me. Don't. Don't. Don't, don't. Don't even. No, 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 no. Uh, all right. Well, I'll go. <laughs> there's there's literally like a player turn guide on the bottom. <laughs> yeah, there is. Yeah, it's there not is. and it's it's not very complex. Move and choose. <laughs> That's all yes. you do on your turn. I told you. See? <laughs> and it even tells you when the game ends. Josh, you need to calm down. I am here for everyone out there that doesn't understand board games so that I can ask the same questions 40 times so they also understand. There you go. It's powerful. It's something. It's powerful. I should just point it out the card from the beginning. And they do this. That's what I was looking at the whole time. You're explaining it, trying to figure out what you're talking about on the board. But you know, some people play board games. Some people don't. So yeah, you know. I haven't touched an actual board game in a while now. It's pretty. Look sad. at that. Matt's winning, saying that he's gonna do bad. Matt is filling See, a Matt, very important role. Exactly. Yeah. And do you know how many more followers we'll get because of ferrets? They're going to be like, shit, they have ferrets? Zero. <laughs> Probably negative five. <laughs> negative five. Ferret love. I'm unsubscribing ferrets. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> I'm, I'm unsubscribing for it. I'm, a, I'm one of the founders. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're super young, though. They're, uh, I have birth certificates for them. I didn't realize they always did that. <laughs> Yeah, because they're two and three months old. They're not. They're not very old. What the heck? Two or five. Well, one or four. What you doing? All right. Got it. Jeez, panic. What are you doing? Well, had, had limited fisherman. options. He's trying for that fisherman's uh basin there. Unlimited power. That. Hmm? No, oh, just there was an error thing that popped up on my side. Oh. I don't know what it was. Those are fun. Mm hmm. What do I need? Let's see. That's, I guess, not too far. Um. Okay. There we go. Sounds like Joe's hacks are kicking in. Dude, you know it. Yep. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hack. Hack. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no, I'm not anymore, Space Dandy. You know it. No reason to hide it. Report me, bro. Josh winning secretly. Yeah, big time. I was going for that card you were at, Joe, but I figured you you had it. Yeah. Problem is, is I keep on like running dry on cards and then kind of having to sit and try to collect again. Yeah. 
that's that happened to me after I bought the Great Barrier Reef. I literally used all my cards. Oh. I was like, hmm. Yeah, then you're like behind for a couple rounds. Yeah. Was like, oh, look at that. Coming back up out of nowhere, Joe. What did that do? That's because he typed in all his hacks, dude. Finish the, since you finished the continent, oh, yeah. you pick the last cube off the continent, you get the map card. Yeah, yep. yeah. Which can range in points. I don't know how many that was. It's just a region bonus. Yeah. Alright. Make sure I don't screw this up. Okay. Screw it up. Do it. I don't want to. You, you no. got it. Screw it up. I have faith in you. You're the best, okay, Nightbot. Yeah. Nightbot is the best. <laughs> Wow, rude, Master Chu. We're going to have to soft ban you for a little bit here. What did he say? <laughs> he said, suck it, Nightbot. Oh, no. uh -huh. I should probably delete that. I keep saying that. I keep forgetting to take that one out. The, the, the donate.downthevent.com one. Why? Because our website doesn't even exist anymore. So... Yeah, it does. I changed it. Oh, did you? Yeah, it still oh. redirects. Oh, never mind. Sweet. I thought our I thought we lost our domain. Oh, we did, but the redirect still works. Does it really? Yeah. That's interesting. I should buy at least the domain, even if we don't do the web hosting. That's funny that they didn't take that down. They probably gave us so many days to like. Uh, mm. What the hell? Player made the same. What? Sorry, give me like a shit ton of airs at the top. <laughs> uh oh. Donate.downevent.com. Yeah, it's still like this. Because it just takes you to our extra life page, which our extra life page exists. Krugar. I know they did the oh, in the US oh, game was a, a big hit. Trek to the national parks? Yeah. Yeah. Did you watch that YouTube uh, or that Netflix show? The board game one? The creator for Trekking National Parks is one of the people they interview, actually. No, I don't know what you're, sh you're talking about. There was a Netflix uh, the board game show that um, Steve shared with us. Oh, no, I haven't watched it. It was pretty good. Okay, where do I need to go now? Jumps into the lead. Finally. Thanks for moving that card down. No problem. Anytime. Holy cow, you got a ton of points there. Woo! Panics just went from last place to second, or I guess third place. Never mind. But still. <laughs> down helps, man. You, you jumped still getting a ton closer. of points. Yeah, you jumped like 32 points or something like that that turn. I completed the card, it was the last on there, and I completed the column, too. Oh, they add you your points for completing columns right away? Uh, I... If you uncomplete a column, do you lose the points? 
How would you uncomplete? <laughs> yeah, yeah using, you will uncomplete them. Yeah, you can using the the bumpy ride. Move one cube in your suitcase to another row. Oh, I guess it would. Yeah, you could technically uncomplete a column. Yeah, I guess you're right. Boom, Josh. Boom. Hmm. I wonder if it keeps it. At, yeah, that's a good. That's a good idea, hmm. actually. Thank you for reminding me about that. Yeah, yeah exactly. No I was just thinking that too. Like, hey. Because can you not collect more than four? Is you that... can collect infinite. Can you? Because yeah. it says five plus players over there on the right, doesn't it? Or is that three plus? Three plus. Oh, okay. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> I should plan ahead to where I want to go next. Nah. Nah. Yeah. I'll just be collecting cards this round anyways, but... Where's that at? Oh, over there. Okay. I thought about trying to get the Taj Mahal. I have everything for it. It's just so far away. Uh, swap, uh, swap spots with someone using two cards. <laughs> There you go. Yeah. I don't know where it's at. Is it over by panic? Uh, it's not really yeah, by. Yeah, any, yeah, it's I'm, not really I'm by three. anyone, is it? I'm three away. I came out really good. Oh, you are. You're right. You want to see what Lindsay made? Lindsay's getting crafty with Thanksgiving stuff. Oh yeah, I like that. I can see the camera. Gobble gobble. Yeah. Sorry, I forgot what I was doing. Going to Taj Mahal. <laughs> yeah, if you're going for that. I should go for something else. I, I, you can go for it too, buddy. You can beat me there. Well, I just don't have the cards. If you already had the cards, it might make more sense to... I mean, you can always block me. Just go sit on it. True. True. <laughs> I'll just go to... One, two, you're three away. Okay. Cappadocia or whatever. Oh, yeah. Oh, guess what's on again tonight? It's a Tuesday. It means it's Moana. <laughs> oh. Is that any day of the week or just Tuesdays? It's Moana night. Tuesdays because Grayson has dance. One of their dance songs is a song from Moana. So then she wants to watch Moana. And every time we're playing board games, I always hear the, it's shiny. Because it's about 40 minutes into the, into the show and her class stops at... Uh, I am a one seven. Gotcha. Hmm. Started getting a little late today, so Moana, Moana. Let's go to Moana. <gasps> he did it. Rude. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. See yeah, how it is. Soup's rude. I didn't really have any other options. Jerk. <laughs> what will Matt do? Machu Picchu. Machu Picchu. Maybe not. Yep, there we go. Get that. Oh, wow. United or North America's already cleared off, too, huh? Now, is that 25 for the whole entire area, or is that just 25 total? What do you mean? Like, at the bottom, how it says, like, 5, 10, 17, 25. Like, is it, like, 17 points, then another 25, or is it just 25 total? I think it's... <laughs> I think it's additional, I believe. That's a good question, though. 
Um, my score did not go up 17, so I think it's just an additional. Because I was at 75, also, and now I'm at 82, so... Okay. It's just no, okay. total. A seven. Lame. <laughs> so you can't hit multiple amount of points. Now the question is now, where do I go now? That's the thing. One over. Yeah, that's about it. To continue to block me. Yeah. Yep. It's all good. You're now you're actually blocking me too, technically. But... Oh, oh. Wow, He's okay. gonna end the game. Ended. Did he? They take the last. Oh, yeah. The... That's the fifth one. No. Oh, yeah. Yes, it is. Mm. He won. How? See, Josh hacks. Do you want the breakdown for you? <laughs> <laughs> How exactly where the points came from? Because I had the most souvenirs for two souvenirs, so that helped me. Because I'm assuming I had red and white. Oh, yeah. Yep. Um, region bonus collected. I collect two region bonuses. How'd you get so many cubes? I guess you got two more cubes than me. That doesn't make sense. You could have landed on areas that didn't have numbers. I never to did. Go to go collect them as um, victory point areas. I don't think I did. I think I always took a cube. Huh. Huh. You had one last turn than me. I did, yeah. And one turn, one turn, I didn't move because I didn't have cards. Oh, there you yep. go. Yep. So there, yep. that's it. Yep. Darn. Because if you look, you have more destination points than I did. I only had thirty-eight destination points. I can't see that. Only you can, because you have advanced. Uh, that they they don't oh, break that down so for you us. Had, you had 40, 40 destination points. Right. Panic had 42. Matt had 40. Um, but uh, number total value of most souvenir tiles collected. I had 19. Joe had 12. Panic had zero. Matt had 11. I don't know what that is. That's the like for having the most white and red. Those are souvenirs. Yeah. Oh, okay. Gotcha. And then so I wonder where the bonus is. Total value of region bonus. Oh, so I got nine points for my two region bonus cards whereas you got four points for your two region bonuses and matt got four points for his one region bonus so i'm assuming the oh, region bonuses are different amounts lame they are they are different amounts yeah both of mine i got were worth two points four. each and yours was worth five <laughs> and four well i'm assuming one was worth six and one was worth three i'm guessing no it says five and four you can see them over there above you your suitcase you have oh, one worth yeah. four, one worth five. I got oh, both yep. both the twos. What a ripoff. <laughs> so that's what won you the game. Lame. Okay. Are we returning and going and playing uh, Can't Stop? Yeah. That's that a fun game. A good game. Yep. Good yeah, game. But... It's quick. I like it. It's being added to my new uh, semi... I don't like so that there's favorite. such a, a big difference in those bonus tiles. That's the only thing I did not enjoy. That's mm. when, when it comes and them being randomly put out there. I'm fine if they were like one, two, and three, but two and five? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> two and five. Is, eh, well, I mean, if it's two, two, four, and five, they're probably like two, three, four, five, I'm guessing. No, two, two, four, four, five, because Matt has the other one. I guess maybe there was wow. a three, but I got both the lowest ones. Dang. That sucks. Shame, shame.